These guys are cruising for a bruising in Uncharted 3, Crushing Difficulty and Treasure Guide. Uh, chapter 14, Part 2. So, uh, I don't know if you can get through this whole area completely stealth. Um, I would try doing it, and then this guy would always somehow notice I would take out one of the guys uh, I would try and take him out but he's you you come up to him at an angle where the game won't give you the stealth kill option for some reason or he's just armored enough where you can't do a stealth kill on him I really don't I'm, I'm not 100% sure on how that works but I can never get it to I'd always get like maybe one or two guys and then someone would see me or something, so. But, uh, this is the area I was saying in the last video. Um, if you wanted to bring that, that hammer with you to use against some of these, uh, heavy armor shotgun guys. Uh, just because it, it takes so many bullets and grenades to kill them. Uh, the the sniper pistol uh i think usually it takes i want to say it takes two or three shots from this thing to take out one of those heavy shotgunners so uh i've, I've never actually like done the actual count to be sure what it is so uh so, once it seems clear, uh... <clears throat> so, uh... So, once this area is clear, uh... You need to move, I think once you move practically to the piano, uh, it'll trigger in the, I think it's two or three snipers above you and the guy with a hammer. Uh, the pain in the ass thing is that when you die, the game checkpoints you all the way at the bottom of this whole area. So you want to immediately, if you do die, you want to run all the way back up here, uh, all the way here, because uh, there, where I was using cover before, those uh, those snipers actually have enough room up there where they can get uh, a clear shot on you. So <clears throat> you want to run all the way back up here and use this first piece of cover. Um, for however little the cover actually is as uh as your protection um this area works out just because coming all the way back here it makes all the guys have to um come up almost like one at a time up the stairs so you're not getting rushed by like two or three guys at once <clears throat> and uh if you're running low on ammo like I am, uh, you want to try and kill at least one of the shotgun guys so he's somewhat close to you. So you can quickly uh, grab his shotgun if it's completely necessary, which it ended up being for me. Um, because these shotgun guys had killed me quite a few times by this point. Uh, <clears throat> and uh, once it seems clear that there aren't any more guys rushing up to you, uh, you have just the the guys up above with the the sniper pistols. Uh, you can kind of use, you kind of edge along here to use some of the structure here as a 
cover so you can get some shots in on them. Uh, this middle area is where the guy with the the hammer is so you want to try and take him out as quickly as you can. Uh, I couldn't really get a good sight on him so <clears throat> So this, I don't really have the best pistol to be dealing with this particular point of trying to take out these guys above me. Uh, if I wanted to get an actual pistol, I would have to risk and run down, which as you can see isn't exactly the best option because I, <laughs> I almost died just right there, so... Um, but luckily that, uh, I think it's the pair of nine was on that table, so I didn't have to go too far, but, so, this is all, like, at, I'm playing this area as safe as I can just because I had, um, died so many points during here, uh, Uh, you know all the guys uh, well actually yeah I don't know where these guys came from I don't know if they jumped down from below uh, from above where I was but they kind of threw me off because I wasn't expecting them to show up uh, so I don't know if they jumped down from above or where they came from but uh, <clears throat> you want to grab the hammer uh, hopefully when you kill the guy it actually drops down for you to grab it uh, you know this area is clear uh, because that doorway uh, to my to the right of the screen uh, will eventually get busted open by I think three guys with shotguns so uh, so you want to have the hammer and just like I actually caught them before they got to the door so you can see them like busting in and as soon as that door opens uh, just unload on them with this thing uh, if you don't have the hammer or if you had to use up all the ammo uh, if you have any grenades you can uh, get one or two in there pretty quickly uh, <clears throat> and then just kind of uh, run through here and pick up any loose ammo that is there and I couldn't find where the hell that ammo thing came up from like it showed up and then I couldn't find it so uh, but before you go left, uh, come over here to the right side and pick up uh, another treasure. And uh, you can probably st uh, stealth kill this guy and then go pick up the treasure. Um, I don't think it really matters which way you do it. Uh, I just decided to go and grab it first before I... Uh, kill this guy and uh, this second guy uh, I should have just started shooting him just because he has the 
he has I think he has a shotgun he has a shotgun or he has that giant light machine gun weapon and but I got lucky and got thrown into the the animation of hitting him with a bottle so maybe I was being a little too cautious on that and deal with that guy uh, if you do shoot that second guy then probably I, I'm almost positive it's close enough where he'll that third one will come investigating what's going on in that room and so I think there's only this and yeah there's this one and then one more treasure to grab and then we'll be moving into chapter 15. Sully! Sully! Snake! 